Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going for more pain and suffering on Civ 4 Deity again. Hey, this is Frederick on Deity. This is the latest Nobles Club, 191. I'll put a link in the description to the where you can download this this map if you want to. So we're going Deity, Normal. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? Um, Germany um, is, uh, well, actually, the German leaders are great. The German bonuses aren't um, that good because they come too late to really affect anything. But we've got uh, Frederick here. Both uh, both Frederick and Bismarck have, have really great traits. Um, Frederick is philosophical and organized. Uh, philosophical is great. Organized is um, it's good. It's not it's not uh, one of the better bonuses in my opinion. It's better later. It's like financial is really good in the beginning. Organized it tends to be really good in the late game. Problem is you know the late game is is probably already decided by the point at point that you get to the late game. Um, but it's still good. It's still good. Um, starting text hunting and mining. Uh, I do like uh, mining. I don't like hunting, so it's kind of an average starting tech combo. The problem is the unique buildings and the unique unit. The Panzer. Panzer is a tank that gets 50% uh, bonus versus armored units, and um, uh, the only reason... I mean, that's basically other tanks or uh, modern armor. And it's like, well... I guess that's something. Oh, and it starts with Blitz. Oh, wait a minute. I think they all start with Blitz, don't they? Tank? Yeah, tanks all start with Blitz. Never mind. There's, there's nothing special about that except the 50% bonus for um, uh, armored units. I guess you could fight modern, modern armor with them, but if you're in that kind of a situation, you're probably pretty screwed anyway. Um, yeah, it's just too late. It comes way too late. I don't like the bonuses, uh, the unique units and stuff that come really late. Uh, assembly plant, same type of a thing. Uh, you can, uh, let's see. <coughs> Sorry about that. Uh, you can um, you can turn four citizens into an engineer rather than two. That's it, it looks like. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, so you can get more engineers, which I guess is good. I mean, there's... Like, there's a use for engineers in the late game, right? Um, but um, still, it's it's not really much of a bonus, and it just comes way too late. I'd love to get more great engineers in the early game. That would be nice. They're really hard to get in the early game. But in the late game, not really such a big deal. So um, this should already have the barbs with their starting text, I believe, is save. Um, unless I'm greatly... Uh, greatly deceived here. Okay, so this is their start. So we got a water start with no um, water resources, it looks like, as far as I can see. Uh, we might want to move. We really might want to move. Um, I don't know, there's no real downside necessarily being on the water. It's actually a bonus because there are like little things like the harbor and stuff that that help you out um, if you're on the water um, that you can't get otherwise. But let me see, where would I want to move with this scout? Um, where might I want to move with this settler is the big question. I might, it's possible I might want to move up here. So with the scout, that, that would really be the only move I might make. So let's go up there with the scout. And it looks to me like there's not really much reason to move up there. Yeah. Maybe if I wanted to make two moves, but I don't want to do that. So we're going to just settle here. No, no water resources whatsoever. Oh, there's gold over there, though. There's gold. Okay, worker. Worker time. We got we got quite a few um, hills here. This could be a pretty good production spot. 
I don't know about the Great Lighthouse, but we could do it. And we're philosophical, so we could get that uh, Great Merchant pretty early. Let me see here. Okay, so we don't start with agriculture. We might as well go agriculture, animal husbandry. Or we could just go animal husbandry, skip agriculture for now. Um, we've got mining. We go, so we can go animal husbandry. Um, and then mining, then bronze working. Uh, there wouldn't be much good in going like fishing, so we could work that. Uh, we could work that water tile. So that's pretty minor. We, what we want to do is we want to probably get out another settler and go grab this this uh, go grab this uh, resource right here because that would boost our our research by a lot. Uh, so we're gonna want the wheel, I think. But um, I think it's legitimate to go ahead and skip. Well, if we go here, we're probably going to want agriculture because we can we can um, work that and then work that mine. Uh, and we could catch up which, once we could work that mine, we could catch up on tech. So since agriculture speeds up animal husbandry, that's probably the best way to do it. All we need is a road. All we need is to get, so we go agriculture, animal husbandry, the wheel, then maybe bronze working after that. Maybe we do something, maybe we worry about barbs, maybe we don't, I don't know. So I'm going to go agriculture, I guess, because my first city is going to be right there, and we want to have that improved, that corn improved. I'm not going to pull anything funky like trying to go for the... Um, like the Oracle or anything like that simply because I, I don't think with this kind of a start you can do that plus it's it's kind of a gamble anyway I used to do that a lot I don't I don't I try not to gamble so much anymore oh my god there's double oh my god there's double gold over there holy crap well that's gonna be nuts Oh yeah, this type of map is um, is uh, was it tectonic? It's it's one that's going to have a lot of hills, so there's going to be a lot of production in this game. Oh my god! Oh my god! Let's see if then there's anybody over there to get that. That's disgusting. Oh my god! How how much gold can you have? We're gonna have some gold in this game. Well, hello. Wow. All right, so that's going to be my first city. My second city is going to try to get that probably. Oh, boy. Napoleon, huh? Wait a minute. You only got one city. How's that? This is a DD save, I'm pretty sure. Is it taking you that long to settle your next city? Turn five? Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess it, I guess it did. Wow. Okay. Oh, he's pretty close to that. Boy, if I want to get that, I'm going to have to really run for it. And that's his second city, looks like. So he's going to be going pretty fast to this spot. If I want, if I want ivory, I'm going to have to really hoof it over there. Yep. He's going to be going really fast. So this is actually a small map, by the way. Boy, I would so steal that worker if I if I had something to steal with. I, I, I'm pretty sure I'd, I'd be stealing workers from him just because he's so close. Okay, so we're like, we're like up against this guy. This is going to be a factor. Pray that your summers be wet. And your winter's clear. Um, okay, so we said animal husbandry next. That's what we said. Or the, the other thing we could do, we could just mine this. And what would that allow us to do here? Um, we could go bronze working. This isn't a bad thing to mine. We could farm this. 
Uh, yeah, we could just go bronze working real quick. And that would allow us to chop up some more settler, or chop, chop up, chop out some more settlers with which we could maybe beat Napoleon to these these spots over here. Um, I would be okay with that. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go bronze working because now I know that I'm I'm up against Napoleon and he's going to get grab all this stuff if I don't. Over here, I don't know yet. I don't know what we got over there. I'm wondering if we should even bother going over there. Because I would rather just sit over here and fog bust this so no barbs pop up in my way. I think I'm just going to sit here like this and just uh, keep the barbs from popping up. Oh, never mind. There goes one already. Ooh. Well, I've got 75 to, I've got a slightly, like, maybe a 40 or 30% chance of actually surviving. I'm not going to take that chance, because even at 50 or 75% chance, I seem to lose a lot. Now, you... Go away, dude. Go away. If I could get him to attack me over a river, then that might push it up near 100. Or not, not 100, um... Just saying. <laughs> Oh, that might push it up near 50% um, uh, chance. Maybe I'd take that. Well, there's no reason to lose this guy if I don't have to. There he is. I'm not sure where he went. Not sure where he is. Okay, we just got done with that that farm there. Next thing we do is we put a mine up here. Oh, there he is. Okay. All right, we found him. So it's size three. Okay, good. I'm gonna fortify right there. Size three, we get a settler out because we we can't wait. Literally, we can't wait. In fact, I'm going to go because of the because it's a small map, and I know Napoleon's going to go for these spots. I'm going to actually settle right here first. I think it's too bad I'm not cult uh, creative. Nice, that's perfect. Okay, size three, pretty soon. Uh, did we get did we get the stuff nothing okay that's gonna be an issue um okay so no copper no nothing which is pretty bad all right so let's go Maybe we should go archery then, just in case. I haven't seen anybody else. This part to my left-hand side could spawn tons of barbs for all I know. And uh, I want to, yeah. Um, no, we don't want to do that, actually. And uh, I, I maybe should have started chopping this out, I don't know. But I'm going archery just to be on the safe side. I don't know, like, what's going on over here. On the other hand, I could go... You think I could go for the Great Wall? I could go for the Great Wall. I don't think it's needed. I could... Do... No, I don't think I have enough time either. You gotta go for that, for, like, from the, from the start. There's another... Yeah, there's another barb. So we're going archery. Oh, you little... Well, alright. Well, that's okay. That doesn't really... That doesn't really interfere where with I where where I was going to settle there. Okay, so he might. Nah, let's not let's not chance it. He he would be attacking over a river. I was fortified. I would actually be at an advantage there, but 
you know, I know my luck here. I'm not stupid. If I could just get up there, then I could get rid of that barb. Or at least in theory. Maybe not. We'll see. Okay, we're going to chop out some stuff here. Okay, there. This this should this should work. He should he should die. He should attack me and he should die. He's going to attack over river, through the woods and all that kind of crap. Well, not now, but it doesn't matter. You should have such a low chance of, of winning. Okay, he's not doing it. Do not it. throw the arrow, which will return against you. Okay, do not throw the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. The wheel? Yeah, I think the wheel. Okay, so... Alright, so where do I want to settle? I think I want to settle probably on one of these ivory... Or actually, I could settle right there and steal all of this. And he could he have no chance of getting this whatsoever. It's not... It's ma mainly like a steal of resources type of spot. Um, how long would it take for me to get over there? This is a kind of a mess here. Yeah, you're going to have to do something probably like that. Okay. Okay, really quick. Let's get a let's get an archer in the meantime because we're kind of afraid of uh, kind of afraid of the barb thing going haywire on us. Great wall! Wow, that oh well, no, the great wall not gonna happen. That's for sure. Okay, we're kind of worried about it coming over this way. I'm going to get another settler out really quickly here. This barb has not cooperated so far. He's still running around. Um, if I go up there, yep, that's going to be dangerous, so we're not going to go up there. Actually, I didn't have to do that, did I? Oh, man. I'm going to get rid of this idiot. Okay, yeah, you're going to get that. You're going to get that for free, aren't you? Oh, darn it. Get out of my way, Mr. Barb, please. You are... No, that's the wrong place to go. Want to settle that spot, but there's a barb in the way. Oh, there's marble up there, by the way. By the way. Okay, good. This means I can get this nice defensive spot. Just don't move over there, please. Okay, good. Good boy. Okay, there we go. I'm going to settle. There we are. Yep, I stole your spot, didn't I? Yes, I did. I assume the barbs have been giving their text. You know what? You know what? I'm going to... I'm going to double check on that. Because if I'm wrong... Uh, technologies. They haven't. Okay. Oops. All right. I thought I thought that this the uh, this save had it um, automatically added, but I guess not. <clears throat> All right. Just go for a worker here. I think that's probably the best thing to do. Or we could no. We could go for. A... Maybe another warrior would be a good idea, considering the fact that uh, this guy actually could come in here and kick my ass if he wanted to. I mean, I'm 
a little bit worried about him doing that, actually. I'm a little bit worried about that happening. Also get another worker out. I I would probably feel better with a, with another um, archer, but if I if I just get another worker, if I just get another worker, because it's there's not a lot of space here, right? It's not a whole lot of space. And if I just fill this place up with like warriors and stuff like that, I think I should. I think I should be all right. I'm gonna have to fortify this guy here. I have no choice. Put your shoulder to the wheel. Oh, hello. Oh crap. Crap. Am I gonna have to? Am I gonna have to whip an archer or something? Didn't realize this guy was coming in here like this. Uh, can I get a warrior? What could I get the fastest here? Two turns, I can get a warrior. Looks like I'm gonna have to do that. What about uh, what about an archer? Archer in three turns. One, two, and I'm dead. No, he can't do that. One, I move one, two, I move there. No, he can't do that. Never mind. I'm worried about something that can't happen. They can smash my stuff, though. Um, warrior. Warrior in three turns. <sighs> Archer in four turns. Archer's going to be more useful. Maybe I could just chop out the archer right here. Um, let me see here. Pottery, pottery doesn't really do us too much. Animal husbandry does. We've got. Uh... Also, I might want to do slavery right now. Because that'll give me the option to whip this archer if, they, if things get really out of hand. Oh, good. What a nice couple of chaps there. Okay, we're going to work this, like I said. Like I said, we were. And we're going to grow. I'm going to build a warrior. And, um, let's see, right here we're going to do what? Apparently, let's build that worker. Okay, and I'm going to hook these places up real quick. Okay, good. Um... Let's do combat one, shall we? Yeah, we got that guy. Okay, so good. So we got marble over there. We got to remember that. So I've got three cities at 2240 BC. That's not too bad. Um, I'm gonna have to go for another warrior here because maybe that guy's still still waiting around in the wings. Maybe not. I don't know. But I got. Um, oh, I ruined that spot, didn't I? Oh, and my greed to get that. I ruined this spot over here. And we don't have a lot of spots, to be honest. <laughs> Oops. Oh, where where else could I have settled that, that wouldn't have done that? Could have settled right on the gold, I guess. Oh, that was stupid. Oh, I almost want to reload after I see that. I forgot about that. Oh, well. Uh... Oh, well, we still got the, the, the side to the left over here, supposedly. And I hope I'm not, I hope I'm not uh, solo with this guy over here, because this guy's a huge warmonger. Napoleon gets slavery, probably finds out that there's no copper. Uh, 
Um, the chance of me killing this guy is like 99%, so let's go for that. Alright. Um, yeah. Another archer? Another archer? Maybe. Okay. Um, we really need to uh, get these things. Uh, we really need to get animal husbandry, basically, is how it, how it goes. I'll get another archer. I'm, I'm not really ready to, like, uh, settle another city. Um, yeah, I should have settled up there, man. What's wrong with me? I could also gotten that uh, floodplain kind of guaranteed. Why didn't I do that? Oh, oh, man. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, I guess you do, huh? I'm going to, I'm going to whip that archer, because if this guy, I don't want to have to rebuild this thing. If he moves over there, I'm going to have to rebuild it. Am I missing something here? Or Oh, there we go. Okay. I'm like, what the heck? I can't click there. There, It's, it's possible there's fish right down in this tile. And if there is, that would be... Then we still got a decent place over there to settle. If not... Well... Then I guess not. Yep, he, he moved where I thought he was going to move. 92%, good. Stonehenge, right. Now what do we want? We probably want to put the rest in that worker there. Or settler. We want to, Do we want another settler? We've got two gold mines here. This place is going to be able to work both of them pretty soon. And that's going to fuel our expansion for quite some time, I would say. Um, so let's definitely think about another settler, maybe to get that marble. We can... We could expand a little bit here with this situation. It's not going to hurt us too much. Well, the warrior, yeah, we, we want to grow here. All right, good. Yes, okay. Now we're making a little bit of money. I guess I want that warrior. And uh, no, there was no, there was no fish or nothing. We gotta start thinking about Napoleon and how he's going to attack me here. He's got all his points on me. I'm the only person for him to attack, by the way. From what I can see. That's something to worry about. I'm gonna start building archers. <laughs> Because it seems to me as if I'm the only person for him to attack. I might choke him. He's not going to be a good trading partner. Maybe I should just choke him. Unfortunately, this is not a very good place to defend from. But, um, yeah, instead of warriors, let's start making archers. Forget the warrior thing. Because we're probably going to have to defend against Napoleon, looks like. I really want to get this place connected, but I don't have time. This place needs to... Yeah, I need to fix everything here. I need to fix stuff. Okay, next turn we're going to get to work that tile. Worker, okay. Can I get to animal husbandry in one turn early? I can. Just curious. Horses? Uh, no. Writing. Okay, well... We also want to get to writing pretty soon. Okay, good. That's good. Yes, that's very good. Okay. 
Awesome. Now we're now we're making some real money here. Um, oh, what the heck? Okay, boy, I'm glad I I'm glad I went archers. Let me tell you. Horses way down there. No copper. Um, <clears throat> what to do about Napoleon is kind of the big question, and I'm not really sure yet. Uh, if I if I kill him, I'll be like isolated from from the looks of it. I don't really want to be isolated. Uh, let's see. Let's get to writing and let's road into him. Let's do that while we continue to build archers because we're paranoid. Rightly so, by the way. It's not paranoid if he's a if he's a dangerous bastard. Not paranoia if he's a dangerous bastard. Okay, and I am getting drowned in barbs here. Let's get a let's get a barracks real quick. Actually, let's get a settler. There's no reason I shouldn't be or either a settler or a worker. I probably need more workers actually at this point. Let's get another worker. Go for a barracks growth. Yeah, let's get another worker. We're going to have a worker there. We we need like workers. Ah, we need writing bad. Okay, good. Okay, I guess that's the best we could do. Let's go writing. He's only got one guy defending there, and that's kind of a tempting, tempting thing. Um, even if I only have archers, if I've got an opportunity like that, <laughs> I might even go for it. Which, which is like, why does he only have one archer? I don't know. No, you can't do it, because I got an archer in there, too. I might just... I might just let this guy go up here. Let's just let this guy go up here, because if I let this guy go up here, I can take him out with this archer, and I can get a little bit more experience, and I can maybe get to the heroic epic. I've got marble up there. Or, well, you know, technically. We don't have it yet, but we will. Yeah, 97%. Um, I believe we should probably get that online. Let's see here. We got a couple of workers coming out here. Yep, let's fix this thing. No, huh? Well, you're not gonna get that. Uh, you're not gonna get that guy in there. I can give it to you. What is his? What is his chances of getting? Well, I'm gonna just, you know, just in case. I I don't trust my luck. I just don't trust my luck anymore after having been bitten so many times. I don't trust my luck. So I'm gonna reinforce with another guy there. Oh, get off there, dude. You don't have to do that crap. As long as he doesn't smash any tiles, I don't care. He's got another settler loaded up, by the way. I'm not sure where he'd be going with that. But I see another settler. What would happen? The Oracle. Ah, man. I would have... Oof. Or was it the Oracle? Was it? True glory consists in doing what deserves to be written, in writing what deserves to be read. Okay, I can get um, I can get another experience. I can get the heroic epic. Whoa! Um, we do have marble, remember, so it might be a good idea, unless I'm going to take out Napoleon. 
Let's open borders with Napoleon. We might... He's He doesn't have, like, anything... That's okay. What can I trade him? Do I have double of anything? I have I have some gold. Maybe I could trade him some gold for some of his stuff. Or does he... he I guess he already has gold, right? Won't trade. No, he already has the gold. Um, I could do... I have... Um, am I going to get more of uh, something here? Okay. Okay, he went... He didn't go towards me with that settler, so he's got stuff up there to settle, apparently. I want to go fishing just because I want to get out... Um, I want to get out of work, but just to explore. Because I'm thinking maybe... I'm thinking I could probably find somebody else real quick. Okay, let's... Um, should we go for a settler here? I think maybe we should. Yeah, we're going to open borders with him. I want to trade him. I don't want to... Actually, let's just trade him. It doesn't matter. We want to start trading for, for purposes of, of uh, getting uh, fixing our relations here, which are going to be bad. Because yeah, once he runs out of room, then he's going to come after me. Apparently it hasn't happened yet. He could come after me right now, for all I know. Okay, I've got... Uh, hold on a minute. No, we want to go for a library for sure. We want to... Uh, actually, I guess we will go for that settler. I guess we will go for that settler. We'll probably, I don't know, whip a library into the settler, maybe? Something like that. Okay. And I'm going to road into Napoleon here because uh, I've, got, I've got the potential to get some trade routes out of that. Okay, we want to go for a library here just to get a border pop. I guess I'm going to skip monuments because I don't have time to really tech for it. I probably got enough um, got enough production here to do it anyway. Library in 30. Yeah. Nice. Man, I'm glad I went archery because there's been a never-ending stream of barps. Literally just never-ending. Okay, no, we don't want to do that. Okay, horseback riding, I don't think so. Mathematics, there's nothing I really need. I'm going to I'm going to wait until I get like a, um, a great... Uh, let's get that, should we get that settler out first? I could get to, I could grow to the next size. Let's get that, um, I don't know, I'm losing, like, I'm losing hammers on that settler is what bothers me. But it's not too bad, though. It's one per turn. Uh, I don't know. I feel like I should, I feel like I should get the settler out first. I'm philosophical. I can wait a little while. Oh boy, this is uh, this is bad. Let's put this guy over here. He's not settling my spots, so I don't really care. That's my spot right there, which I want. Um, but he's not settling there, so I'm not really too too mad about what he's doing. Oh, you're going to do it like that, are you? Well, I'm going to want to probably... I I can... No, I can move this guy right here. That's no big deal. 
Yeah, he's not he's not threatening me yet. Um, I am going to put a road there though. Two turns for that settler. We're gonna settle a couple of spots here. Okay. Yeah, I want to settle, um, we want to settle up there. And I'm going to probably chop this too. Probably want to go, don't go too, not go too crazy though. Alright, I'm going to go back to getting that library. I want to save some forests because we're going to want to maybe I mean, I want to maybe get like the Great Library or something. So we don't want to go too crazy on the being of the forests and stuff. Then again, I, I want to get that stuff out. It's at some point though. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna grab that marble before anybody unseen gets it. I don't I don't know if there's anybody that's gonna get it, but. Just to be on the safe side, we're going to get it. Okay, finally got that. Okay, and we got hooked up with this guy. And he doesn't have a red fist yet. He does have an axe. I see he's found, uh, managed to find metal. So that's something to be aware of there. Getting another settler out. We're gonna settle that spot up there. Um, I don't know where else I would settle. I could settle, I definitely wanna get those horses. So we're gonna have to settle down there. This guy could probably move over here. You know, I'm really having trouble with that left click. I'm really having trouble, or the right click. And I'm wondering if, um, wondering what's going on there. Is it the game or is my mouse starting to get about? Oh, don't do this. This is, this is lame. Okay, fine. I'm not having too much trouble with that, that click there. Oh, I see. Oh, we're going to steal another spot from Napoleon, looks like. So should we steal there or steal there? This is probably technically closer to my place. Over here, I grab a bunch of, like, desert tiles. Over here, I grab a few more other tiles, so... Well, sorry, Napoleon, you lost again. You lost again there, bro. Hill's defense, nah, I'm not gonna do that. Let's, let's move it. Okay, so, yeah. We're four cities, he's five cities. I'm gonna get another Another city, six cities. Um, yeah, no, no problem there. This place, we're just going to build a library, and we're probably going to chop out the library. Oh, there's um some gold over there, but I can't get that. Aesthetics, nah, not yet. Let's wait until we get like, let's wait, wait until we can really research. Alright, let's continue to go over here and see what there is. There is, hmm. Hmm. Go for aesthetics now? I think not, I think not. Okay, this guy can, this guy can get on here. Let's, let's just heal these guys up real quick. We want to go over there. Go ahead and put a road there. We need to put a road over here too. Yeah, we'll, 
we'll do this first. Oh, I don't have masonry, that's right. We need to do masonry really quick. Okay, and I need to go over here and I need to grab those horses. That's priority number one. And uh, we also need to go chop out that library over there. I'm gonna go down here a little bit. I don't wanna get too crazy. Okay, this guy could stay here. Um, what else here? I wanna get a work boat out because I'm really curious about anybody else I can find like through the water. That guy could chop that, that's fine. We're working this. Okay, that's fine. Um, I guess I could chop this too. That would help a little bit. Okay, let's go down here. Chopping time. Does it look like he's... There's no red fist so far. So, he must have... Usually what happens is they'll run out of land and then they'll red fist you. Okay, I'm having trouble clicking again. Maybe I just don't know how to click anymore. Leave this guy here. Actually, let's put this guy over on Munich. Let's not take any chances. The Great Lighthouse, okay, I probably could have done it, but I don't think it would be worth it. Napoleon would have too many cities by now if I would if I would have done that. Okay, um, maybe one turn earlier, no? No? Okay. No, okay. Fine. from their foes, not their friends, that cities learn the lesson of building high. All right, I'm, I'm barely growing over here. Thinking I might want to just get another settler. That's probably the best thing to do over there. Uh, what are you doing with that settler there, Napoleon? Uh, just curious. Just curious there, bro. I don't like the looks of that. Aesthetics, not yet, not yet. Okay, well, we do have horses, and that's unfortunately that looks like that's the only thing we have over there. Five turns, huh? Okay, five turns for a, uh, a library. Uh, he doesn't. He doesn't seem to be like trading with anybody. I mean, I don't. I think I'm like. I'm stuck on this place with him. What I could say, oh no. Well, he did somehow get something there that popped that border there. I'm gonna get, I've gotta do something about that. Didn't expect that to happen quite so soon. Okay, well let's, uh, let's chop this away. Is this literally it? Or do we have like, Oh. Well, maybe I could go up there in that case. Looks like bad luck. I've got a barb galley. Bad luck with the barb galley there. Okay, so um, mids don't have stone. More archers, I guess. Mm, okay. I'm trying to see where else I could put down a city. There's, there's spot, there's room, but there's nothing like, there's nothing like good in those spots. Okay, anyway, should we go for aesthetics now? There's no reason to when I don't have my marble. I'm just gonna wait. Oh, 
is there like fish? There's no fish. Seriously, there's no fish or nothing. I'm just gonna settle there just for those horses, I guess. It's like, yeah, there's, I don't know. Well, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should have settled right there, but I don't know. There's like, a, dude, that's pretty. It's pretty crappy. It's pretty crappy. There's gonna be like uh, not a lot of food on these spots. That's just how it's gonna be. I guess I might as well go aesthetics. He, he, he'll probably never get to alpha anytime soon. But if I can get that marble, which I can. If I can get that marble, then I can build, like, the Great Library and all that good stuff. I'm gonna keep pushing over here and seeing if there's anything. Uh, we need more workers, probably, don't we? Well, there's okay. There's wine. Oh, you—he's uh, already got it. Never mind. He's already got it. Yep. Got the wine, do you? And the pyramids. Who knows who built those? Who knows? Oh, there's a Barb City. Really? Um. Okay. Well, let's build a cellar, I guess. I don't, I don't really have anything else to build. Wish I did. That's why I'm going to aesthetics. Um, barracks, yeah. Okay. Okay, we got our library here. Finally. Settler. Settler, I guess. Uh, library. I guess. Looks like he's going to build my quarry for me. Um, and we got this crappy city. There's there's a freaking, uh, freaking food source over here, which I could grab. So he's probably going to settle, like, right there and get both of those. He's gonna, so he's going to have elephants. Oh, no, maybe not. Well, then he's an idiot. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Got something more there. And then he's probably going to start stacking guys over here, and then he's probably going to attack me. And I don't have metal. I don't have metal. I might have. I, I might might want to go for iron actually. Okay, the aesthetics thing. We're we're gonna ignore that for now. Okay, library in three. That's fine. I guess we'll just, uh, in order to save a turn, or no, I don't need to do that. Okay. He's probably going to settle somewhere over there. So there's a couple more spots I could grab if I'm quick. Um, yeah. Scientist did three, two, and I don't know, he's not, he's not settling, which is good news. Uh, 
Um, I want this spot. I want this spot right here. Maybe right here. Gonna have to go iron working or something. Yeah, let's grow and grow in five there. Capital two turns. Yeah. All right. I'm waiting for that great scientist to hit the gas on my research, basically. So he's still not settling over there. You got a nice capital there, bro. I got to admit it. Pretty decent anyway. Pretty decent. Okay, got my library there. Going barracks. Okay, and I got my great scientist. She's going to speed my research a little bit. Not a lot. But a little bit. Um, I prefer to... Let's get to size 6 before we get that next settler. Um, let's see here. You know, I just realized that this place would be a would have been a better. Oh my god, this place would have been a better place to put that uh, that um, that great scientist that that academy. I just, I, I geez, <laughs> how could I have overlooked that? How did I? Well, you know, I can get another one pretty quick. We can get another one. We can get another one real quick because uh, because we're philosophical. So let's put let's put another one over there. Why not? And okay. So I want. To Okay, we want to settle over here, maybe over here too, or maybe just destroy that, or maybe we just yeah, maybe we just steal that spot. I don't know. Two more set, two more, two more settlers at least. At least I think. Of course, the other thing to worry about is the fact that they're pretty far away from my capital, and that's going to be. It's going to require... You know what? Maybe I'd better just... Um, I don't think I'm going to get along with a Napoleon. I don't think we're going to get along with Napoleon is the problem. Maybe I just better start planning for war instead of like settling these cities way out over here, which are kind of long-term investments. Um... So maybe instead of going over there, well, where could I? What could I do? Is the other question. I mean, I could conquer him and vassal him. Could I actually get any trades out of him? I don't think he's... I think he's pretty stingy. I think he even has to be a pleased... I could maybe gift him a city. And then I could get him to pleased. Oh, I don't know. Let's see. I probably have to go like... Um, man, sucks. quite sure how how I would do this actually I don't want to if I put cities way over here this is gonna be a real maintenance drag it's almost too late to go horseback riding but I could still do that if I could get you know what um, if I could get the heroic epic then I mean we got some places over here that could really rock with a heroic epic in fact my capital would be an excellent heroic epic spot um, too bad I put a, too bad I put an academy there, huh? But, um, 
yeah, we could go for the Rook Epic. I think I'm going to stop expanding. I think I'm just going to get my marble. Um, we're going to put, like, maybe another city down over here. Just, it's going to have to be, it's not going to be a very good city. Maybe right, well, I need iron working to, to make any use of that, unfortunately. Go to horseback riding, go to something. It doesn't really matter. We can get the Great Library and we can get the Heroic Epic. And um, after that, we decide what we want to do. Once we have both of those, then we should be making enough, uh, enough research to do whatever the heck we want. And hopefully he doesn't attack us in, in the meantime. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go over here. We don't exactly know where we're going to settle this yet, but it's kind of like a blocking. Oh, never mind. Oh, okay. Is an empty phrase. Art for the sake of truth. Art for the sake of the good and the beautiful. That is the nice move. Yeah. All right. I forgot about that. Um, actually, I forgot that you don't see red fist. Because um, <laughs> uh, because there's nobody else to attack, so I'm not going to see a red fist. Dang. Okay. Well, live and learn. I think um, let's try this. Let's try this one again. I think we'll restart this one. This is uh, isolated with the French. That's kind of tough. Isolated with Napoleon. That's kind of tough. So, all right. Well, now that we kind of know what's going on, um, oh man! And of course, he's got the medal. Of course, he's got the medal. Yeah. All right. Well, I guess let's just restart. And um, we'll try this again. Now that we kind of know what we're up against, at least maybe we can uh, maybe we could figure out a better strategy. My strategy was pretty scattered. Um, I shouldn't have put that. I shouldn't have put that. Uh, shouldn't have put that academy right there. I didn't know that I was isolated with him. That kind of changes things because when you're isolated with him, you know for sure that you're the target. Um, also didn't help the fact that um, I just managed to find horses over there. I don't know. I didn't go for iron, but uh, I don't know. I suppose I probably have iron somewhere in here. But the fact that like my only attack resource or resource to defend myself is way over here, that's really it's really bad. And he, I guess he has, um, he got... He probably got iron. He probably didn't get... Yep, there it is. Right there. Yep, he got iron. Okay. Alright, well, let's... Um, let's see if we can do this again. We'll just replay this map.